Hello and welcome to Rocket Systems YouTube channel. Today in this video we are going to write a basic OpenCV based Python code to do inferencing on our JSON device. Now you must be wondering why we are doing this because we have already covered this in our previous video. But there is a difference. In the previous video we used JSON inferencing libraries to do inferencing on the JSON device. But what if you need to use OpenCV? What if you need to use OpenCV to read the file and then perform different different OpenCV operations on that particular frame? In that case you won't be able to use the JSON inference library because OpenCV reads the reads the frame into the numpy format while the JSON inference is expecting it to be in the CUDA format so it becomes a bit difficult. In this video we are going to see how we can combine these two and use OpenCV to read the frames and then perform inferencing using the JSON inference. So let's get started. So I will be doing the inferencing over this test video file but you can still go with your webcam or any other RTSP camera you have. Now let's open a terminal and let's create a new file named app.py. Let's import the CV2 package. Let's import the Jetson inference packages. And let's also import imutils because we are going to resize the frame. After this, let's read the file using CV2. Now let's import our model as well. So we are going to use the same command. Now let's read the frames. Here let's resize the frames. And then let's pass this frame into the model. But before we do that, because this frame is in the numpy format, we will have to convert this into the CUDA format. So for that, let's take another variable image and we'll call the Jetson Utils library. And then we will use CUDA from NumPy. This is going to change the format from NumPy to CUDA. After this, we can pass this image into our model. So we will use detections equals to net dot detect. And then here we can then use for loop to loop over all our detections. Let's draw a red bounding box on all the detections. Okay, now once that is done, let's simply use cv2 dot am show.
and then simply destroy all windows okay so let's just quickly revise so we have imported all the packages we need here we have imported our video file you can use any webcam or rtsp camera here we are loading the default ssd mobile net model now here we are reading the frames from the our video file this is where we have resized it and this is where we are converting the numpy format to the cuda format after that we have passed the cuda format image to our model and then here we are printing all the boundary boxes of the detections and this is where we are simply displaying this so let's try to run this to see if it's running fine or not okay there is an issue that's fine so let's just quickly go and perfect so we can see that it's the code is running perfectly fine so what we have done is that we have used OpenCV to read the frames from the video file and then we have passed that to our Jetson inferencing model now the good thing is that you can obviously do any object any image operations you want to do on your frame but if you were using only the Jetson inferencing then it will be a bit difficult for you to do that so I guess that's all for this video thank you for watching this video please like share and subscribe